Hi YouTubers! I'm getting ready uh, to go on a little trek on Lake Beauchatel in Norton, uh, Quebec with my snow scooter. Yep, look at this. A snow scooter. I don't know if you can see it well, but you'll see it when we get out there. We're not very far out, so we should be there in about 20 minutes. So, check this out. Well, here we are, and we are on location. I'm gonna go, well, we can't really see it from here, but I'll put it on my sleigh. See, we're getting on the lake from here, and the lake is down in there. So I'm gonna show you. It's snowing a little bit, but hey, it just makes it more fun. So. Here we are. So we're on the snowmobile track. I just want to get to the lake. I'm on the approach to the lake, but I want to get there in the open. So if you know there's snowmobile coming in fast, they'll be able to see me. Because up here, I doubt that they will be. Might be quite a carnage there. <laughs> You'll see when it opens up on the lake it's beautiful. Even if it's snowing, that track is not as hard as I thought it would be. Hopefully. Well, we'll see. There's a few ice chains there. softer than I thought. Oh well. We'll take our time. See, there's not one track. There's many of them. This to be there was only one. Makes it easier. Because it gets hard. Now there's many of them. Oh well. We'll take our time. No rush. We're outside. We're on Lac Beauchatel. And there's snowmobiles coming. Way at the other end. A little faster than I am. A little bit, needless to say. <laughs> That's beautiful. So, uh, hey. Whew. I don't know if you can see, but this is a pretty lake. This lake here. Apparently, in some spots, you've got about 300 feet of water around the, the island, which I don't know where the island is, but 300 feet of water is a lot of water. Whew, tired. Must be good for ice fishing today, though. Should have brought my stuff, but I just wanted to be out take a little bit of air, fresh air, and enjoy it. Which, that's what I'm doing. And trying this little, uh, this little device here, which is a lot of fun. And hey, if I'm tired, I just have to sit on it. <laughs> and just rest. So, yep. Let's go a little farther and see what we can find. Hey guys, Whew. 
quite a ways on the lake here. It's beautiful, it's snowing. It's mild, relatively mild. Uh, they're talking about minus 10, so it's nice. Very nice afternoon. Man, look at this. Take a hold of this. Isn't that nice? And right over there, whoops, sorry about that, is what they call Mont Kekeko. Beautiful place. You can actually go and hike over there. It's, uh, see, it's a beautiful mountain. There's snowmobiles going around. It's a beautiful place. Wish you guys could be here. Well, okay guys, like I told you, let's get on the way back. It is snowing quite a lot. It's a beautiful day though. It's mild, but a lot of snow. And those little things there are, well, let's put it this way. It's easier on a flat track, okay? I mean, uh, on a solid base which uh, we don't have right now. Uh, it's quite soft, so it's pretty hard to, well, not all that hard. It is hard to just uh, go at it. When you're on a snowmobile trail, which is, you know, a good solid base, then you're okay, but just doing like this, well, Good exercise anyway for a 61 year old guy I'm getting cardio <laughs> and it's fun how you beats being cooped up inside right so guys uh, I'll get to the truck when I get there I'll put the camera back on might take a little while. So. Whew. Yeah. Although we're not that far, we're about ah, what? Made about two kilometers on the gas. Just about a mile and one point uh, two point some. <laughs> not very far. But uh, softness there in the ice, I wish you could see. Hey, you all guys, back at the uh, at the track. See, and I'm gonna fit this. And those little two knobs that, uh, well, we can't really see them. I'll show them to you in a little bit. But uh, you know, the funniest thing is. Uh, <laughs> Let me turn this around here. I actually was uh, talking to the small camera for about two minutes, three minutes. Then I realized that, uh, oh my gosh, okay, I got no power. So I got the big one back, the big old trusty can in here. So uh, guys, I'll uh, start on doing the backpack and then uh, I'll show you those two knobs I was talking about. So we'll talk to you in a minute. Look, take a hold of this. Isn't that pretty? Not me, but the scenery. There you go, guys. Those are the two knobs I was telling you about. All you have to do is boom, undo them. And this here comes apart easily. And not to lose them, just to put them back on, on here. Okay, there you go, I'm doing all of this with one hand, I'm sorry, and all you have to do here is pull on this, here you go, it goes down like this, seats, goes like this, and uh, all you have to do is grab it, swim, but uh, put it back in my truck, there you go. Well, here we go, guys. 
Whew. Batteries are just dying. Uh, I'm just back from uh, the lake, as you can see, snow and everything. Now I'm going to have to find out a place to turn around, just to let you see how the snow is picked up. Look at this here. It's crazy. Kind of. So, uh, well, hope you enjoy what you've seen, and if you did, please subscribe. Please tell a friend, leave a comment, give me a thumbs up. Hey, and I'm Guy Martin here. Until next time, I'm signing off from Norton, Canada.